Hey, while you in the first five seconds of the video, go ahead, like and subscribe. Shalom Israel, this is Bishop Nathaniel. I want you to know that you can view all our Sabbath classes live on IUIC TV. That's right, I said on IUIC TV. Download the app today. Shalom. So God told us to go and get thee unto the house of Israel and speak with God's words. So in order for us to come out here and preach this Bible, we must be speaking the words of God. To who? The children of Israel. The so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. You are the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Why are you called the lost sheep? Because you lost your identity. Today you think you're Hispanic, Mexican, Puerto Ricans, Cubans, Guatemalans, black, African Americans, Haitians, and Jamaicans. These were the names that was given to us in slavery. God said that we should come out here to you Verse 11. Read verse 11. Verse 11. Hey, you young kids right here. Y'all come in real quick. I want to ask y'all a question. Can I ask y'all a quick question real quick? Very important. Come in real quick. Come here. Come around here. Come on, come, come, come on around. I want to ask y'all a quick question. How you doing, bro? My name is Zephaniah. What's your name? Okay. What's your name? Zeke. Y'all got some powerful names. Hey, sis, what's your name? It's okay, sis. We here, we here for our people. Angel, What's your name? Your brother, sis. Angel. Angel. Kaylee. Kaylee, I want to ask y'all a quick question. Who is this right here? Step back, son. Now, y'all step. Come, come, come around right here. Come around right there. Right there. Stand right there. Kaylee, who is this? Who is this man? Who is that? Do you know? Yeah. That's God. Who, who you say? Jesus. That's Jesus. Who you say, Kaylee? That's Jesus? Okay. Who is that? Satan. Say it again. Say it on the mic. Satan. Say it loud. Satan. This black man is Satan. What do you say? Who he look but who who do he look like? The devil. Look like the devil. He he black, right? Yeah. He look like you. Right? Because you're black, right? So you saying black people look like the devil? That's that what you saying? And this person looked like God. Let me get that scripture real quick. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you that according to the Bible, this man right here is Jesus Christ. That's right. You understand? And this man right here is the devil. That's right. Okay. Watch this. We gonna play three strikes. Look, you confused. You like what? All my life, I've been shown on TV. The preacher been preaching to me in church that this is Jesus. I'm going to show you. Watch this. Read that. Revelation chapter 1 verse 1. It's the book of Revelation chapter 1 verse 1. Now, hold on, hold on. Give me Matthew 24 and then we're going right back to Revelation. I'm going to show y'all something, a prophecy that was going to come to pass about this right here. About our people being confused about who Jesus Christ is. You understand, bro? Who is Jesus Christ? Is this Jesus? Is this who you learned growing up, though? That's, so who is that? This man right here. Who he look like? Like a, like a black person. Like a black person. Okay, cool. Watch this. I want, what's your name? Eric. Eric, watch this. Pay close attention. Watch what this Jesus the Christ speaking right here. The book of Matthew, chapter 24 and verse 4. Yeah, read 4. And Jesus answered and said unto them, Take heed that no man deceive you. So Christ, so the disciples was asking Christ, they say, how are we going to know that we're in the last days or that you are on your way back? Bring it out. This is what they was asking Christ. Say, so Christ said that a lot of things is going to happen on the earth. So the disciples was like, well, how are we going to know these things are coming to pass? How are we going to know that you're on your way back? Christ said, the first thing you should know, don't let nobody trick you. Don't let nobody deceive you. Read. For many shall come in my name, saying, I am Christ. So it says, many shall come in my name saying, I am Christ. What people can't say that they are Christ today? This right here. This is what you learn, right? You learn that Jesus Christ was a white man. Who taught you this? The white man. 
Okay? So now this is the prophecy that Christ said, many shall come in my name saying, I am Christ. Jump down to verse 24. Bring it out. For there shall arise false Christ. There shall arise what? False Christ. Read that again. For there shall arise false Christ. So the Bible says there shall arise false Christ. Y'all know what a false Christ is, right? Something that's not what? Real. It's not real. So there's going to be an image that's going to pop up or a man that's walking around saying that he's Jesus Christ. Bring it Let's out. see how Jesus looked. Give me that in Revelation. Teach. Give me that in Revelation real quick. Now I'm going to show y'all what color Christ is. Start at verse 1. It's the book of Revelation. Chapter 1, verse 1. The, revel the revelation of Jesus Christ. The revelations of Jesus Christ. I'm going to make this quick real quick. So the revelation means to reveal. The Bible says the revelation of who? Jesus. So the Bible is going to reveal to you what Christ looked like, okay? His color and everything. Jump down to verse 10. Verse 10. I was in the spirit on the Lord's day. Hey, brother, come and learn. Come and learn something real quick. Okay. All right. Our people ain't got time. Okay, watch this. And heard behind me a great voice. As of a trumpet. Hold on, sis. Watch this. Let's get to the point. Watch this. Verse 14. His head and his hair. Read with power, bro. Read it. His head and his hairs were white like wool. So the Bible says Jesus Christ, the hair on his head and the hair on his face was white and woolly. Which one of these images got white woolly hair? That one, right? You know what texture woolly hair is? Who got woolly hair on the earth? What people? Black people. Black people. Read that again. His head and his hairs were white like wool. So the hair on his head and the hair on his beard was white and woolly, right? Watch this, watch this, read on. As white as snow, it was fully white. So this one ain't got no white woolly hair, right? He got long stringy hair, right? So that's one strike against him, correct? You with me? Watch this, read on. And his eyes were a flame of fire. And his eyes were as a flame of fire. Which one of these eyes are red? Bingo! So it's two strikes against this one, right? Two strikes, right? Read on. And his feet. And his feet. So John looked down at his feet because he had on sandals like this young brother got on. But they didn't have socks on at that time. So he looked down at his feet and he said, and his feet like a two fine brass. Y'all know what color brass is? What color is brass? What color is a penny? It's brown. When you look at brass, you look at a penny. It's brown. So John looked down at Christ's feet and he said, you got a penny in your pocket? He said his feet was like fine brass. So if your feet brown, what color would your legs be? What color would your stomach be? What color would your arms be? Brown. What color would your face be? Brown. Y'all brothers is smart. So John looked down at his feet. He said that his feet is like fine brass. As if they burn in a furnace. As if they burn in a furnace. So if you take something that's already brown and you burn it, what color is it going to turn? Black. So which one of these is Jesus? Good job. So Jesus is a what? Say it. Jesus is white. That's right. Jesus is black. And this man is the devil. Do y'all understand that? I want y'all to understand that Jesus the Christ looked just like you. Do y'all understand? So which one is the devil? Good job. Excellent job. I want y'all to always understand that, okay? Jesus Christ is a black man and he look like you. That, gonna, that should build up your cup. Look, I see you smiling. That should make you feel good. It should make you feel amazing. Watch this. Give me Jeremiah 14. Because they put this image out here to make our people think that the white man is superior. Right. But the greatest man that ever walked the earth looks like you. And guess what, brother? What's your nationality? Puerto Rican, the so-called Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, we are the same people. We're the children of Israel. Your Savior is a Black man. When Christ returns, he's coming back to put the Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans in power because we broke God's commandments and we went into slavery. We went into slavery because we broke the commandments. You know that the Puerto Ricans was in slavery also, right? They was conquered by the conquistadors. They went into slavery first. Only reason why we're in the conditions that we are in today is because we break God's commandments. What is the nation? Nation is family. 
Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation is children with role models. 